Hi Sagittarius, welcome to Willow Oak. I am here to do a general reading for you and this reading is all about positive possibilities, okay? So anytime that you find this, it's timeless and you want to watch it, there will be something in here for you, all right? And this is all about what possibilities exist that are po positive in nature for you. Mm -hmm. So I'm excited to see. All right, let's see what your first card out is. Dolphin, this and that are true. Okay, that's an interesting card. And what that is just saying is that um, you can see something one way, I can see it a different way, and it can be the very same thing, okay? And or that there can be more than mean one meaning to anything, all right? So we'll need to get some more cards to find out more about that. But it is beautiful. Dolphins are wonderful creatures. Mm -hmm. Actually, they're very fascinating. Okay, let's see what else we have. Protection, beautiful. So during this time, you are going to be protected. Mm -hmm. It could be the angels, source, somebody down here on the earthly plane that's looking out for you. It could be all the above. I usually see that as angels. Okay, let's see what we have here. Regeneration. Beautiful. What this is saying is it's kind of like the death card, right? Where it's an end to the past and a new beginning that is beautiful. And during this time you're protected. Now the one thing here is this and that are true. So maybe it's the way you're seeing something. You, um, you know, if you are feeling bad and you know, you're thinking about something. It's so easy to see the negative side of it. And if you're happy, you can look at the very same thing and see the positive side. So this kind of seems like that is what is going on here. But whatever that is, if you are seeing a challenging side to something, this is letting me know that you're protected and it's a new beginning. So whatever it is, your perspective is definitely going to change. Beautiful. Yep. Here we have the Ace of Swords and it's a new beginning, right? Right here, it's a new beginning. A new beginning, this and that are true. What this is letting you know is you are going to have a very clear way of thinking, of seeing your truth, the truth, and going forward with it. It's a beautiful beginning. Mm -hmm. So it looks like, whoa, something in the past, or it could be current, you know, because this could be, you know, in the future. It's something in the past or present. You are seeing more of a truth on the challenging side. And here, you will be changing, regenerating, you're protected, generate, regenerating, and seeing the positive side of whatever this is. Oh, look at these, beautiful. Okay, here, right under protection, you have the Three of Cups. And the Three of Cups is saying is it's time to celebrate. Time to get together with the people that you care about, that you love, and celebrate. And for me as a reader, this also means your support system. Mm -hmm. um, so 
if at any time you need help, you know, maybe to get through this, to see things in a different light, go to your support system. They are here for you. But this is also a celebration of your new beginning. Okay. Here we have a tower. So, a tower moment is coming in to shake things up for this new beginning. And it could easily be you bringing on the tower. Mm -hmm. Because what I'm feeling here is you're seeing the two sides, but leaning on the challenging side. But you are evolving and having this new beginning where you're seeing it for how it really, truly is. And you have your support system and celebration. So yeah, it could be either or. You know, whether it's an outside tower coming in or you bringing in this tower. But it kind of feels like it's you bringing it in. And towers can be tiny. They can be big. They can be positive. They can be challenging. They can, you know, it can be a variety of things. But the one... Um, constant here is that it is a quick change. So whatever is happening here, you're going to have this enlightening moment that will most likely come in quickly. And then the last card here is judgment. And you can see by this image, it's you awakening, you know, rising up to the new you. Beautiful. Love it. Okay, let's see what else we have. And remember, you are protected. And you also have your support system here with you. I love doing these readings. You know, the, the um, positive possibilities. I'm finding out I'm, I love doing these. Okay, here. The Four of Pentacles. It can be seen in a few different ways. One, it can be seen as a challenging energy or a positive energy, depending on the cards it's with. Um, it talks about holding on too tight to something. In this case, in this image, it's Pentacles, but it can be anything. So it's quite possible that you are holding on too tight to a version of what is. And you need to release that. Right? Have this tower. Have your support system with you. Have this tower so you can see things clearly. And this regeneration will happen. And you are protected. And something to add, it's not in these cards, but because of the protection, like I said, you have your support system. But your angels are here for you too. They're protecting you. So if you need help, Ask your angels. You have free will, so if you want help from them, you need to ask them. And you're going to rise up. It's going to be a whole new you. So this can say, let go of how you're feeling about a certain subject. And only you will know, because this is a general reading. That's, yeah. I'm not even going to go into the other one because that's definitely how I feel about this. You're letting go of this kind of hard belief that you've had in order to regenerate. Mm -hmm. And at the bottom of the deck, you have the Ten of Swords, which is talking about you letting go of these challenging emotions. So this, to me, is the emotions that you've been holding on to. You're letting them go. And you're going to your sunrise. So here you have an end to the challenging times. Thoughts. Here, it's regeneration. You know, it's a new beginning. Here's a new beginning of clear thinking, right? You have a lot here that is talking about Letting go of the old way of thinking and bringing in the new way that is true. Not just perception of a negative kind, but what is truth. 
beautiful. And the tower would say that once you reach a certain point, and I do think it's a self-created um, tower, once you reach a certain point where you realize you're leaving this behind, it is not right, then it's going to happen quickly. Okay, let's clarify. And let's start by clarifying the dolphin spirit. This and that are true. Which is true for everything. But see if we can pinpoint a little bit more here. Three of Cups. Okay. Well, you have the Three of Cups here. So you have it twice. That is the universe's way of saying, I meant what I said. Okay? So some of this interpretation really needs to be up to you. But this is saying it's time to celebrate. But remember what I also said here. To me, it's also your support system. So it could be how you're seeing it. But I think I don't think that's it. I think what this is, is the answer, the outcome of this. This and that are true. But here's your support system here for you, along with the protection, right? Right here is the Three of Cups and the Three of Cups. So it is a time of celebration. And it's also a time for you to realize that people are here for you, your support system and the spiritual side. So you have both the earthly plane and the spiritual side that want to help you with this new beginning and let go of the old. Wonderful. Okay. Let's get a card for the Ace of Swords. And nah, love it. <laughs> Again, no synchronicities. I mean, no coincidences. Only synchronicities. All right. Now, if you take a look at this, this is, like I said at the beginning of the reading, akin. These two are very much alike. Regeneration. This is death to the old and the beginning of the new. And it's right on top of the Ace of Swords, which is a brand new beginning. One where you are thinking clearly. So this is just confirming this. Yeah. You're letting go of the old and bringing in the new, which is going to be so very positive. Mm -hmm. You are rising up. What a beautiful clarification. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, there we go. We got one. <laughs> I love this. I do. I've got to do more of these positive possibilities. I love these readings. Okay. The clarification for the Judgment Tower and Three of Cups is the Six of Wands, which is victory. So, going through this tower, which I do feel, it could be the or, but I do feel it's self-imposed. And with the help of your support system, you're going to be celebrating because you are rising up to the new you. And you're going to be victorious. Wow. Wonderful. Oof, that one's come out. King of Wands. Here you go. Yeah. Another wonderful uh, clarification. The King of Wands is a mature energy. Okay. And... They are very attractive. They're very passionate. They go for what they want and they get it. Okay, here, these are very different. Holding on tightly to something you feel you really can't let go of or shouldn't let go of. And this is telling you, no, you go for what you want and you get it. All right. And at the bottom of this deck, you have the Hermit, which is saying, go within. Find the answers to what you're seeking. Find your enlightenment. All right? So that's advice. So yeah, this is full of transformation. To me, it's one big message. 
in your very first card, this and that are true. How are you looking at things? Are you looking that, at them from a challenging point of view or from a positive point of view or a constructive point of view? Realize that you are protected and you have your support system here as well as celebration. So on the spiritual plane and earthly plane, you have the help. It's going to bring in a new beginning. Right here is a new beginning. Death of the old, birth of the new. Brand new beginning where you're thinking clearly. You're going to be rising up and you're going to be victorious. You're going to let go of holding on so tight and going for what you want. And here, of course, is letting go of these challenging emotions, beliefs, whatever they may be. So it's absolutely beautiful. Okay, let's close this out with an angel card and see what they would like to share. Yeah, definitely do need to do more of these. I love them. They've got to be my favorite so far. And the cards are definitely showing it. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see what we have. Peaceful resolution. How beautiful is that? Absolutely beautiful. This gives me chills. So, even if there is a tower involved, it's going to be peaceful, all right? Yeah. I love this. Absolutely beautiful. Still have chills. Okay, well, thank you so much. I do hope this helps. And if you like it, please give it a like, share, subscribe. It will do a lot to help me. And also, it will allow me to know if I've been able to help you. So, thank you so much. Beautiful. Have a wonderful time. Much love. Bye.